Hello everyone, and today I got a special video today, and and I'm testing this video with my new camera. I'm using my new camera, actually, I should say, on this video. So if it may be different, then it's due to the new camera, and today I got something different for you. So, if you have seen in some, maybe some videos on my channel, I got some pops, but I actually have been collecting vid pops for a long time. And I have like 30 of them. I have a lot of pops and I thought I'd show it to you because it's a really big collection and it's pretty good for a person who just started collecting pops this year. So we're going to go from here, 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 here. And we're going to go from top to bottom and keep these pops for last. So let's get started with Yoda. He's one of the Jedi Masters. He's pretty cool as a pop. And then we got Finn, one of the main characters from Star Wars The Force Awakens. And Rey, who is basically the main character from The Force Awakens. Then we got one of my favorites, BB-8. He's, he's pretty cool in the movie. Even if he doesn't really do much. And then we got Darth Vader, a.k.a. Anakin Skywalker. He's the main villain of Star Wars. Not in the new movie, though. And we got one of the heaviest pops I own, Rex, from Toy Story, who is like a dinosaur. No wonder why he's so heavy. And then we got one pretty, pretty nice one with Will Ferrell on it. We got Buddy the Elf from Elf. Moving up, there's Snoopy and Woodstock. Snoopy and Woodstock have to be together, like Han Solo and Chewbacca, but whatever. That's Star Wars. And we got Anger. He's really angry now. And he's looking pretty angry during this video. Next, we got my one and only Marvel Pop, Captain America. And he's right here. And he's looking pretty good. And he's looking like he comes from some kind of Avengers. Then we got Han Solo. A.K.A. the old one, not the young one from the other ones. So it is Han Solo from Star Wars The Force Awakens reprising his role as Harrison Ford. <laughs> then we got Chewbacca. Chewie, we're home. <laughs> Chewie, you're home in my pop collection, but it's Chewbacca, one of the... a Wookiee. Now we got C-3PO. He has a red arm in... In this, and he, he did have a red arm in the movie, so. Not to spoil anything, but he has a red arm and a C-3PO. And then we got one older pop that's like R2-D2. He's not from the new Star Wars Force Awakens movie, but he's R2-D2. He's pretty cool, and he's like. And then, let's move up. We got E.T. characters now. We got Elliot, and he has like that Reese's Pieces in his hand. And it's Elliot from E.T. And then we got the main one. E.T. the Extraterrestrial. Oh, this is one of Steven Spielberg's greatest films. So, we got E.T., one of the, an alien. Gertie, who is E.T.'s sister, probably. It's gotta be. It's, it's El, no, Elliot's sister, yeah. Why did I even say that? But Steven Spielberg, you should go on to make more Jurassic Park pops if you haven't done that yet. Then we got Disney, Simba from The Lion King. And then we got Batman. Oh, yeah, Batman. The Cape Crusader is here. And he's a pop, and he's... What is he from? Batman. He's just Batman. A Batman pop. Then we got Joy from Inside Out. Oh, how lovely. Is it to see Joy in the collection? She's Riley's main emotion, and it's just Joy. My sister was Joy for Halloween, if you didn't see. Then we got Charlie Brown. And Snoopy and Woodstock was actually my first, by the way. Charlie Brown, he's the, he's the main star of Peanuts. Then we got Mickey Mouse, who is just... He's an amazing Disney character. He's probably Disney's mascot. He's It's amazing. Then we got Roger Rabbit. From Who Framed Roger Rabbit. Pretty good movie. And 
And Roger Rabbit's looking pretty cool. And then we got Dave from this Pickle Movie 2. Of course, Dave. They forgot about him in this in the new Minions movie, so they had to make him Despicable Me 2. And it's Dave from the movie as a Minion. And how many Despicable Me 2 pops are there, actually? So, it's Dave, and we got another movie set. An entire set of one. Poe, not Poe Dameron, but the Poe from Kung Fu Panda. I can't wait to see Kung Fu Panda 3, and... The wait is finally almost over. And it's almost here. So so it's great to get have Poe in our in our collection of Kung Fu Panda, not Star Wars. Then we got Tigress, the tough tiger from Kung Fu Panda. She's pretty cool. And I believe there's only three in this set. And one of them is a repeat. Poe with hat. That's what it is. It's Poe with a hat. <laughs> Just the same old thing, but you just had to put a hat on it. Now, we'll have to move on to here, which is we have Hiro Hamada. And in his suit, not like he's regular, his regular Japanese approach, and he's Hero from Big Hero 6. Then we got a big one. We got Baymax. Whoa, it's super big, but... But Baymax is really important to the movie, so it would be so cool to have, like, a big Baymax pop in our collection. And then we got the Back to the Future Time Machine, which is the biggest pop that we have. It's really big, and it comes from Back to the Future. And it's the main time machine that they use in the movie. And I wonder how my pop collection will grow. So, as is, we have 30 pops currently, and... And that's a pretty large amount, and hopefully you enjoyed, and we'll have more pops coming in the future. Bye!